Kony the Chihuahua Minasan. Today we're gonna take a look at Kamen Rider Gachado vs Kamen Rider Legend Episode 2 Trailer. Let's go. Legendo. Okay. Whoa. That is a bold statement. Gorgeous time. So this is a really really interesting second episode preview because in the preview trailer itself we actually get to see DK and we also get to see Kamen Rider Legend using the form DK as well. So this is really really weird because like why would Legend ever want to use the power of Decad because Legion power is basically the same as the power of Decad in on itself uh, unless you are telling me that maybe that the Legion finisher move is weaker than Decad's finisher move itself so if that is the case then what makes Legion so special compared to Decad itself? I'm not sure, but we are here to talk about it. And one of the dialogue that we saw in this uh, preview trailer is that Kajiki actually say like, wow, Legion is on a different level compared to DCAT and even ZO itself. And we clearly see this as kind of like an insult to the previous two anniversary rider. Like DCAT is by far like fan favorite of all time and ZO is supposed to be really really strong as well and it, I, I'm not sure like what role Legend is gonna play in the story moving forward like who is this guy supposed to represent and who this guy is supposed to be are we gonna see him in the future are we gonna see him in the 10th Reiwa series is he gonna be the 10th Reiwa series rider I highly doubt it, okay? I don't think Legend is gonna be the 10th Reiwa anniversary rider for the Reiwa generation itself. But I, I felt, but Legend could actually potentially be one of the rider in that series, or maybe Legend would just actually be a spin off rider that we would never actually get to see in the future moving forward, okay? So, really, really fun stuff. Let us take a look at the trailer scene by scene to kind of like figure out what we can learn okay so the first thing we immediately get to see is Kajiki and Hotaro and also Kaguya in the same room and we actually get to see Hotaro is wearing a very very fancy clothes and I felt like this is legend trying to teach Hotaro how to be gorgeous okay how to be fabulous how to be beautiful I don't know what else to say but really really fun stuff but i really felt like this scene like when they actually said like wow kaguya is like way beyond decad and and zo is like I, I i i'm not sure like why do they actually want to say that like why make that insult or maybe it's not really kind of like an insult but maybe it's kind of like a it's 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 a piece of dialogue that a character actually said just to show us what level actually is for Kamen Rider Legend itself because I felt like Legend, not gonna lie, is pretty OP especially with his gun and his ability to henshin into different rider. If you can summon rider and then you can also henshin into a different rider, it is gonna make you really really insanely powerful. Okay, so I am not sure like how the hell did Legend got the power of the rest of the rider? Did they beat it out of them or or maybe just help them just like Sukasa did? I'm not sure, but hopefully we get a little bit of hint in this trailer. Next scene, we get to see the, I think this is the scene where Hotaro was being dressed up gorgeously for the first time. Next, we get to see some costume change and she's wearing kind of like a huge robe something like that so maybe it's cold <laughs> what am i saying next we get to see hotaro getting angry so we might actually get to learn a little bit of truth like what is actually happening here like why why and how exactly like kaguya get all the rider power something like that and next we get to see decan okay so this is i would believe to be 
the real decad itself and the reason why i'm so confident to say that is because look at the driver we actually get a little little glimpse of the driver at the bottom of the screen itself and this is not the legend driver itself but this is in fact the og decad driver it's not if it's not even the pink color decad driver this is the silver decad driver itself so I'm not sure what Dickhead is doing here and why is he fighting with the hundreds, but it's really, really interesting for us to actually get to see Dickhead making a return. I don't think Masahiro Inoue is going to make a return as Dickhead as Kadoya Sukasa, but they're, they're just, I think they're just going to use the form Dickhead and have someone to kind of like voice over as a character or something like that, okay? Next, we get to see the main villain of the series. He's using a... What, what what is the the time watch something like that and it is the oma zo time watch okay so that is really really interesting because i think we actually get to see zo's time watch but we never actually get to see oma zo's time watch so this is the guy and this is the monster form or the rider form something like that i'm not sure and yeah really cool stuff we get to see uh, Foze and built form by Kamen Rider Gachat itself. So this is pretty interesting, pretty ugly as well. Not not kind of like a big fan of all the golden color and all those stuff. I, I understand what they are going for there, but making it golden, it kind of like lose a little bit of the, the, the beauty of the OG Rider color. I felt like if they actually mix in the original Rider color and the that just just boldly embrace the colors of both rider like build and Foze, and that they are gonna create a really really wonderful wonderful car costume and wonderful form itself i i think there are there are people out there on the internet actually tries to do this already like they actually tries to recolor the suit and it looks amazing i love it okay next we get to see this is cyclone and O's form by Kamen Rider Gachat as well this is Cyclone Joker and Tatoba 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 <laughs> so really really amazing thing we get to see here I did not expect O's and O's and W would actually have kind of like a combi form something like that because I think it's kind of like a color mismatch in 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 on itself okay like it is like green and purple and then we got red yellow and green wow the color combination is insane but it it works okay it works next we get to see this guy in bright days shine sunlight something like that i'm, I'm not sure like what they are thinking with this maybe like did they overexpose the footage or something like that or maybe they purposely shoot it like this because they have the intention to add on the special effect like kind of like the glowy dreamy effect to the footage itself to make it more gorgeous i am pretty sure that is the case okay and next we get to see him using throwing a few chemicals i towards gachat maybe or maybe yeah he's gonna throw the 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 card to Gachat itself so that is amazing and then we get to see our boy DK being used by legend itself this is the most like mind-blowing thing I, I actually see man like getting to see DK being DK's form being used by another rider just it doesn't goes well in my mind because all this while it has been established that DK is the one that changed to other rider and we are not gonna see another rider that actually uses the form of DK but here we are okay here we are seeing this happening this is really really insane but it is still a really really cool scene for us to actually get to see this happen and yeah I think that is the end of the trailer really really exciting stuff here if not mistaken uh the second episode is gonna come up on 26th of november if not mistaken i am not sure how many episodes we are gonna get for kamen rider legend versus kamen rider gachat but i hope we actually get to get to see a wonderful wonderful conclusion to the story like we if they want to make legend into a villain at the end of the day it is all good with me if they want to make him into a hero 
all good to me as well. Okay, so I I don't think he's gonna be the villain. I'm just I just wanna make it clear here. I think he's just gonna be kind of like a asshole. Not like asshole as well, like kind of like more eccentric type of hero, something like that. So, yeah, we just have to what what wait and see to wait and see what they are gonna do with Legend itself moving forward. Is he gonna join the main storyline of Gacha? Maybe, maybe kind of like a one off, one episode special, or maybe two episode special because. If Legend actually joined the main cast of the main rider roster of Kamen Rider Gachan, he will either needs to be nerfed or he will need to die in the series for the entire series to make sense. Okay, because if if Legend doesn't actually got nerfed or died in Gachan and he made it into Gachan, then Gachan doesn't need to evolve. He doesn't need to grow stronger. He can just like, hey, Legend, can you help me settle the Atri Abyssal sister? And that's it, okay? So that, that <laughs> I don't know We I, I don't think Legend is going to join the main cast But that is not saying that The driver Would not actually make it into The main series itself Maybe we're still going to see the driver But recolored Repurposed To make it into another rider Something like that Maybe, maybe not We are not sure But with that being said, that is all from me. Hope you enjoy. If you like what you see, you know what to do. Subscribe and I'll be seeing you guys in the next one. Goodbye.